Hi and welcome to episode 187 of A Year of Living Sincerely. Today I'm at the laundromat, the coin operated laundromat, and washing comforters. And I'm going to have kind of fun because I've got too many comforters in this load and it's shaking the entire building. It's really fun. And we got only one more minute left. pouring down rain outside. So surfing's appropriate today. This is how we surf in Cincinnati. We don't have oceans with waves and stuff. We make waves. Oh, I heard this yesterday. It was a laundry accident. Don't get dizzy. Get dizzy. It's done. Three comforters in here. But it was express. I don't think they weigh 45 pounds total. And they fit. So I did it. Now we gotta dry it. My washing machine at home is in this day. So heavy. <laughs> hey, this one's too big. One more thing. I thought in our Taking Down Cancer segment of the show. I thought this could be a little fun. quarters. I actually lost a cat that way once. I was on my way to school and our washer and dryer were out in the garage and on my way out I threw a load of laundry into the washer and then on my sister's way to school she threw things from the washer to the dryer and but our dryer didn't always stay shut so on my mom's way to work she re-shut the door and then pressed start and so then on my way home from school I came in and started pulling stuff out the dryer 
and I thought it was my mom's fur coat, but it was my cat. Anyway, I have lots of kind of tragic cat stories. So I also have um, a pretty tragic bird story. I have a couple of them. But I have this one tragic bird story where my sister and I used to own bird, have birds. And mine was named Kepler after an awesome volleyball player that I um, admired when I was in high school. And then Jenny's was called Lemonade. And my bird ate all the food and her bird died. So that's a pretty sad bird story. And I have a, a few sad um, fish stories too. One time we had these fish when my kids were little. And Amanda's, name, Amanda's fish was named Princess Odette. And Mikey's were Minnie and Mickey. And Matt had one named Dumbo. It was a silver dollar fish. And Dave's was named Rambo, and I can't remember my fish's name, but they all started coming up floating at the top of the fish tank, and without eyeballs, and pretty soon it was down to Rambo and Dumbo, and Dumbo ate Rambo, eyeballs, and killed him. And so we were kind of disturbed by Dumbo and tried to flush him down the toilet, but he kept swimming against the flush. Whoa, what is that? What should we do with it? Go back in. Nice. All done. Whoops.